everyone. I wanted to come on here and share the latest word given to Julie Wedby. She received the word on August 8th, 2020, and it's titled, The Battle is Raging. My Remnant Warriors Have Prepared for This Day. My word is like fire. It brings together, but it also divides. If the trumpet call can't be discerned, who will prepare for this battle? I tell you, it is my chosen remnant who have prepared. My truth seekers know that I am my word and my word alone is truth. All else is an illusion. I am the God of truth. I am just and righteous. My word divides the soul from the spirit and is the discerner of every man's heart. I know those who I have chosen that serve me and I hide them under the shelter of my wing. I am the rock and the saving strength of my anointed. You who are called by my name will be strengthened and I will uphold you with the right hand of my righteousness. You will not be shaken and you will not be moved. No weapon formed against you will prosper. You have my power over all the enemy and nothing can hurt you. I will make your way perfect and I will fasten you as a nail in a sure place. You will be for a glorious throne to me. The one who believes in me, the cornerstone, will never be shaken. I will not take my eye off you, my righteous ones, and I will enthrone you with kings and exalt you forever. To him who has the key of the house of David, what is opened, no one can shut, and what is shut, no one can open. You who overcome are my kings and my priests, and you will reign on the earth as my ambassadors of light. As representatives and my messengers on earth, you will uphold my law and my word will, be, will forever be on your lips. I am your light and your salvation. You will not fear anything. I am your stronghold in the day of trouble. Be strong and courageous as I will always go with you. I have trained your hands for the battle. This fight is not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, and against spiritual wickedness in high places. I have taught your hands to war and your fingers to fight, but not with a sword or a spear. Not by might nor by power will I slay them, but by my spirit. Mighty exploits will you do in my name. Your enemy will know my victory by my mighty hand through you, my chosen instruments, declaring my word, my sword of truth. All who have ears to hear will be sanctified by this truth. So blow the trumpet in Zion, my watchmen and my children. Sound an alarm in my holy mountain. The day of the Lord is at hand. Your bow is renewed by my hand. You are my war club. Your I'm sorry, your bow is renewed by my hand. You are my war club and weapon for this battle. With you, I will shatter nations and bring kingdoms to ruin. A fire will devour before you and behind you the flames will burn. You are my chosen, set in battle array and my camp is great. I will drive out your enemy before you as I give you the command to destroy him. I will make them eat their own flesh and they will be drunk on their own blood. Then all will know that I, the Lord, am your savior and re your redeemer, the mighty one of Jacob. I will go forth as a mighty man and stir up jealousy like a man of war. I will roar as I prevail over my enemies. I am a warrior and the Lord is my name. Declare a thing to be and it shall be so. My word will not return to me void. All will be done according to my word, my chosen remnant. Your gates will always stand open and the riches of nations will come to you. You will receive your rightful inheritance. No more will you be oppressed and persecuted once my spirit fully indwells you. Out of you will flow rivers of living water. You will turn hearts to me and I will cause righteousness and praise to spring forth before the nations. I am coming, I am coming. My Elijah company has prepared the way of the Lord. 
Rejoice, my beloved, for the fulfillment of all things has come. Yahshua. And she says, as I was writing this message, his Holy Spirit instructed me to then take the, his message and write a prayer that we as the overcomers can recite as a declaration, hallelujah, for he is the word and the only truth that can be found. Thank you, dear Holy King Yahashua. We adore you. There are also two more prayers that confirm this message below the list of scriptures. So I'm going to read this uh, prayer out for you guys. The cry of the remnant prayer. Your word, Yahashua, is like fire. Your word alone is truth. Your trumpet has sounded and I have prepared. Please allow your Holy Spirit fire to burn away anything left in me that is unclean or not in alignment with your holy will for me. You alone are the God of truth, righteousness, and justice. I have chosen to serve you with all of my heart, all my soul, all my mind, and all my strength. Hide me under the shelter of your wing because you are my rock and my saving strength. You answer when I call you and you strengthen me. You uphold me with the right hand of your righteousness and I will not be shaken or moved. No weapon formed against me will prosper. You have given me your power over all the enemy. You are my cornerstone and I will not take my eyes off you. You have the key to the house of David and what you have opened, no one can shut. And what you have shut, no one can open. Your way is perfect and you have fastened me as a nail in a sure place. I will be a glorious throne to you. I am your ambassador of light, and you will make me a king, a priest on the earth. I will uphold your law, and your word will forever be on my lips. You are my light and my salvation, and I will not fear. You are my stronghold in the day of trouble, and I will be, I will be strong and courageous, because you always go with me wherever I go. You have trained my hands for the spiritual battle and my fingers to war. It is not by power or might, but by your spirit, that the enemy will know his defeat. I will do great and mighty exploits in your name. I am your chosen instrument, and all that have ears to hear will be sanctified by your truth manifested in and through me. I am blowing the trumpet and sounding the alarm this day. The day of the Lord is upon us. My bow is renewed by your hand, and I am your weapon of war for battle because of your presence in me i will shatter nations and bring kingdoms to ruin a fire will go before me and a flame will burn behind me for your camp is great i will destroy the enemy before me with your command then all will know that you are the lord my savior and redeemer the holy one of jacob you will roar as a warrior and prevail over your enemies the lion of judah the Lord of hosts is your name. I declare all you instruct I declare all you instruct me to declare, and your word does not return to you void. You will cause my gates to stay open, and the riches of nations will come to me. I will receive my rightful inheritance. I will never be persecuted or oppressed again. Out of me will flow rivers of your living water. I will turn hearts to you and righteousness and praise will spring forth before the nations. You are coming. You are coming. Prepare the way for the Lord. Come, precious Messiah. Yahashua. Amen and amen. And I'm sorry, it says Mashiach. Yahashua. Um, scripture reference given Jeremiah chapter 23 verse 29 1 Corinthians chapter 14 verse 8 1 Corinthians chapter 9 verses 25 through 27 2 Timothy chapter 2 verse 5 2 Timothy 3 16 through 17 Deuteronomy 32 verse 4 Hebrews chapter 4 verse 12 Psalm 91 verse 4, Psalm 28 verse 8, Psalm 18 verse 32 through 35, Isaiah 41 10, Isaiah 54 17, Luke 10 19, 
Isaiah 22, 23 through 24, Isaiah 28, 16, Job 36, 7, 1 Samuel 2, 8, Psalm 113, um, 7 through 8, Revelation 3, verse 12, Proverbs 8, verses 15 through 16, Isaiah chapter 22, verse 22, Psalm 18, verse 32 through 35, Revelation 5, verse 10, 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verse 20, Psalm 27, verse 1, Joshua chapter 1, verse 9, Daniel eleven thirty two, Ephesians six twelve, Psalm one nineteen thirteen, Job twenty nine twenty, Jeremiah fifty one twenty, Genesis forty nine twenty four, Deuteronomy thirty three twenty seven, Isaiah forty nine twenty six, First Samuel seventeen forty seven, John seventeen seventeen. Zechariah 4, 6, Joel 2, verse 1 through 11, Isaiah 42, 13, Exodus 15, 3, Job 22, 28, Isaiah 60, verse 5, Isaiah 60, verse 11, Isaiah 66, verse 12, John 7, verse 38, Isaiah chapter 61, Revelation 22, verse 12. And then I'm going to leave the link to this word in the prayer in the description box. I love you all. And I pray that you all have a blessed day.